Let's get the grunge stack set up by copying the create remix script. We'll paste it here. We're going to create a customer service app and we're going to install dependencies. This part takes a little bit, so I'm gonna speed it up a lot while this gets us all set up and runs the end-to-end -end test and everything to make sure we're all set up. Let's open up this app in our text editor and then open the readme. And the first thing we're going to do is create a new GitHub repo. So we'll call this customer service AWS. We'll make it private, create that repo, and then come back and follow the instructions to create our AWS keys. So we're going to log into our existing AWS account and then we'll go to the console so that we can create a new access key. And then we'll go to our settings in GitHub for our actions to add secrets for those access keys. So first we have the access key ID, we'll copy that over. And then we're going to have our secret access key, which will go to a new secret and paste that in. And with those set up, we just need to set the session secret environment variable for both environments, both staging and production. We'll initialize our Git repo and commit it. And now we'll just copy paste this so we can push to this GitHub repository. Once we get all that pushed up, we have all of our code on GitHub and our GitHub action is running. Now this takes a couple minutes, so we'll speed this up a lot. And when it's finished after a couple of minutes, we can go into the deploy step and we'll see in the production deploy that we have a link to our production deployed app. And now we've deployed the Grunge stack to production on AWS.